add some dynamic functionality to our cart icon up here so we can see exactly how many products are in our cart currently. So what I need to do is go back to the app.jsx, navigate to my navbar components, and I want to pass a cart items property to this. And what I need to do is pass in the cart state function from here. And what I'm going to do is go ahead and shrink down my terminal so I have more space to work, but we will need that back in a second. And once I pass this to my navbar component, I need to go to my navbar.jsx and make sure I pass it in here as a property. Now, just before our shopping cart icon in our navbar.jsx, I want to use the cart items property. I want to see if the length is greater than zero. And I'm gonna use my and operator to run code if this is true, meaning that we have items in our cart. We want to display a paragraph element with a class name of item count. And then we simply need to dynamically render the cart items dot length here. And now you guys can see, since we already added one item to the cart here, it will display one. Tap here for more.